Thank you, Chair. Dear Mr. Chairman, distinguished delegates, ladies and gentlemen, let me, from the very beginning, to thank the organizers of this great event and to wish all of us success in meeting the ICT community's expectations. Uh, it is of a great pleasure for me to address you today at the WTDC, especially considering that the Republic of Moldova was honored to host the first IT regional preparatory meeting in this regard in uh, February last year. So uh, our goal was to identify regional priorities for the development of ICT sector and to formulate our contributions to the WTDC as well as to raise the visibility of the ITU as a main facilitator and supporter of the information society development at the global level. Dear colleagues, the ICT development is absolutely recognized as one of the most important elements for social and economic growth. Fostering future infrastructure and content development, the ICT education and cybersecurity are the main conditions for enabling a modern information society. This is why, uh, with active support of the ITU and in continuous consultation of the ICT policy developments at the global level, especially of the old summit of the Information Society Action Lines, the Minister of ICT of Moldova developed last year and is successfully implementing the new National Information Society Development Strategy, Digital Moldova 2020, which outlines four sets of actions as extending the connectivity throughout promotion of network competition access to Internet services, promoting ICT education and strengthening the utilization of capacities and benefits offered by ICT, development of the local electronic content and services, raising confidence and fostering cybersecurity. After a few years of the consequent implementation of the previous uh, policy documents, one of the directions in which we had essential success is the establishment of the competitive electronic communication infrastructure at affordable price. In the last week, OCLA Global Broadband Speed Test, Moldova was rated with six positions between leading countries in the world with average internet speed of 29.5 megabits per second. The progress infrastructure development allowed us to obtain in a short period of time an internet penetration ratio of 64% of population with a high level of demand for developed local digital content. This way, another priority at this stage is the implementation of the Government transformation project, which proposes to increase the accessibility and developing public e-services. The Government effort is expected to serve as an example for other stakeholders and to give dynamic to the development of the Information Society services and to proliferate inclusiveness. Ladies and gentlemen, I should note that the work of the ITU, its bureaus, bureaus and study groups, development programs and regional initiatives was and remain vital for development and implementation of national ICT strategies in different member countries. In order to respect or to respond to society's needs and expectations, all involved stakeholders have to keep a permanent dialogue and to promote permanent inputs from each other. In this context, it's worth to mention that one of our expectations is that the Union, following its mission, and among other objectives, its objectives, will contribute to foster international cooperation and to develop interoperable, non-discriminatory international standards and to assist developing countries in their knowledge and application of its recommendations. This will be a huge contribution to reducing the digital and standardization gap between developing and developed countries and to maintain a close coordination mechanism among the three union sectors for bridging the digital divide. And this is the approach we experienced as a very successful in the last few years. And I will use this opportunity to thank the General Secretariat, the Telecommunication Bureau and its regional office for permanent involvement and continuous support provided to my country for the implementation of its ICT agenda. Thank you for attention. Thank you.